the meeting is good. The meeting is good in the sense that we are now in the process of negotiating how we are going to organise um, the eight, and get around the 18 points. Um, there will be some roadblock due to the uh, preparation for Merdeka Day. We are actually taking note of that and uh, working out with the police in terms of the details because uh, we are not sure where are these uh, 18 points, uh, how they are going to do the roadblock. Lah. The police has actually said that they will help us to facilitate the security and also safety of the uh, protesters. Lah. So it is good, it's positive and uh, we are now going to have to work out the details. Lah. We are hoping that we can resolve this by tomorrow uh, and the rally will go on. The community is surrounding Dataran yes. because of course we know that you know the uh, Mateka celebration, the preparation is going on yeah? um, and we will not disturb it because we still respect the Mateka Day but they also have to recognize that this uh, birthday 4 is also part and parcel of Mateka. We want to celebrate yeah? Mateka Day. And, so. and, um, and it is people's way of uh, celebrating Merdeka, calling for a nas uh, at a national level for a, a change. So therefore, we are not entering into Dataran, and therefore, we are also stopping before the Merdeka Day. So, on the 30th eve of uh, Merdeka Day, we are definitely dispersing the crowd. Uh, right from the start, kita hanya kata the, in the vicinity of Dataran, bukan masuk dalam Dataran. So there's a miscommunication. So kita dah clarify dengan polis. Sekarang uh, mereka ha, um, saya rasa yakin ya mereka faham. Uh, no, I I would disagree that we will harm the economy. In fact, I if if yeah um, they actually listen to the reform that we want. Yeah, and the reform that we want is clean and fair elections, a clean government. You know, a government that really can work for the rakyat um, and also give back our right to actually membanta, to actually dissent, uh, to discuss and to comment on laws and policies. Uh, it will actually bring back the confidence that, you know, Malaysia is doing well and good and on the way to economic recovery. I, I think that if we were to bring in the institutional reform, um, it will correct back the economy.